So in this question, we're given the end points of the diameter of a circle, their coordinates, and we're asked to find the equation of that circle. If we know the centre of a circle is AB, and we know the radius is R, then the equation of that circle will be given by X minus A, squared plus y minus b squared equals r squared. So to find the equation of a circle we need to know the center and we need to know the radius. So what are we given? We're given the end points of this diameter negative 7, 3 and 1, 5. Now to find the center It'll be the midpoint of that diameter AB. The centre is, we find the mean of the axes, negative 7 plus 1 over 2, and the mean value of the y's, 3 plus 5 over 2, average them. So negative 7 plus 1 is negative 6, half is negative 3. 3 plus 5 is 8, over 2 is 4. So the centre is negative 3, 4. I'll just check you've got that right. If 3 to the left and 4 up looks right on this diagram. So always check when you've got a diagram that things are looking OK. So that's the centre. The radius will be the distance from that centre out to the circumference. Either it's CB or CA. Let's choose C to B. C to B. And in this case, we'll use the distance formula, where we've got the x difference squared plus the y difference squared of the two points. So 1 minus negative 3 square that and then the y difference 5 minus 4 and we square that. So we've got the square root of 1 minus negative 3 is 4, 4 squared, 5 minus 4 is 1, 1 squared. So that's 16 plus 1, that's the square root of 17. And that's the radius. So the equation of the circle, and this is where we use this formula that you're actually given in the exam on your formula sheet. We use that formula. So the equation of the circle is x minus the x-coordinate squared plus y minus the y-coordinate of the centre equals the radius squared. Well, that's 17. Squaring the square root of 17 is just 17. So let's just tidy that up. It's x plus 3 all squared plus y minus 4 all squared equals 17. And that's the required equation.